I don't really feel very good. I have body aches and a stuffy nose and Erica can smell something that I can't. So I'm trying to log on to the CVS website right now to make an appointment and it looks like this. Infinite loading. I'll keep you posted. Okay, so update. We have tried to make an appointment uh, at CVS to get a test for the last 45 minutes. No, at several CVS, CVSI. <laughs> we got an appointment. And now I made Erica wake up so she could stick this thing up my nose. I'm gonna take all your noodles. It's gonna go all the way back to my brain. Yeah. Well, we're at CVS. Erica's really mad right now. It's a very long line. This has been the line. I think we're just gonna keep waiting. So I'm about to get my test. I'm smizing. Erica was saying I'm gonna hate it, and I am. You know what you would hate more? Is not going to go get tested and accidentally exposing a bunch of people. I would hate that. I would hate that too. That would be not okay. Cause that would be like, like feeling not well and like going to work and exposing people, you know? Yeah, and I don't want to do that. No. I had this whole plan to go see my folks for Father's Day, bring my dad some barbecue. Maybe they'll just have to go pick it up. I might have to order it and go, go get it. <laughs> we gave you a chore for Father's Day. <laughs> Happy Father's Day 2020. <laughs> oh my god! It's it's interesting being asked to like perform a test on yourself or on someone else when you're not trained. Um, and it feels like a scary thing to feel like you're hurting somebody else. It's important to make sure that you do it correctly. It, you get like this little tickly nose brush. It's friendly. And you put it up your nose, one side. And then you just swizzle stick it all the way up to a point where you're like, oh my god. <laughs> Am I in her brain? Maybe. I but I'm definitely this. in the spot where I'm gonna be able to collect enough of a sample from that side to be able to do it. And then you swizzle it down and then you swizzle it up the other schnoz hole. <laughs> it's important to do it right. Because if not, I mean, this test runs risks of false negatives. It's important to be vigilant and tickle your loved one's noses. That's gonna make me laugh. Oh I'm my God, very, she'll probably laugh. I'm very ticklish. God. It's going down for real. Hold that. Here's your little sample juice. This is the important part. What do I do? Just like this? Just You just go to a place. Oh my god, you're fine. I'm scared. Look at how friendly this looks. Okay, okay, okay. ready, just, ready, just ready, ready, ready. Let me just do it. Okay, which side ready? first? Okay, turn toward me. Thank you. Ready? Tickles. Ow, ow. Okay, count. Count to 15. This is 50. And this is 50. 15. This is 50. Is that enough? Oh my god, yeah. Okay, ready for the other side? Let me have the other side. Uh, Come on. Okay. Okay. Okay, ready? Okay. Oh my god, what's in there? Okay, here we go. Ow. No, no, no. Ow. No. Nice. Nice deep breath. Ah. Two, three, ah. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, two, three, one, two. Okay, are you done? Uh -huh. Okay. Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm crying. You have your lab bag? Oh my god. Thank Look you. at my face. Did I do okay? You did a really good job. Oh, that is awful. Your brain is really ticklish. Oh my god. That was awful. But it's already over. Worth doing and not that awful. Not that awful. And I don't feel that sick, but I just want to be safe just in case. There is high risk of exposure, guys. This is happening. We're like in the armpit epicenter. We're number one. So be safe. If you're not feeling good, go get tested, please.